Hey everyone, so today I'm sorry <laughs> I don't have a process video because my kid was homesick and it was challenging enough to simply scrapbook uh, and she was here all the time. Anyway, so I didn't get to film my process but this was really really simple and I want to explain to you how I made it and hopefully um, you know that'll be enough to explain it. So my theme for today is to use these uh, little cutie patooties from the Horizon collection and uh, I mostly used or maybe I just used the pattern swatches because I just find pattern paper easier to use but um, these are really fun as well and it's really really easy to create uh, fun designs with these and you can find lots of ideas also from the other team uh, design team members. I had to use these and create um, what's it called? interactive element <laughs> so this is what I made and I will fill this out with uh, journaling about um, being a mom because <laughs> my theme is also um, Mother's Day which is coming and yeah so I'm going to uh, add um, some stuff in here but this was really really simple basically I took a strip of white cardstock and I left it you can see it's it's still 12 inches wide and what I did was you can trim it down to you know like measure it and figure it out and everything these are two by twos but I really find the easiest way is to start from the corner of the of the page and then just glue three I decided to go with three you can do four or even five um, of these squares and then I trim it you know trim it at the top and score it on the side and this is just a really really easy way of creating this and okay I guess I need to add some more adhesive that's always the thing with chipboard pieces right okay so I will add adhesive to this once I'm finished uh, filming and that's basically it and then I just punched a little hole here and here and I put a piece of thread through it and then I added a lot of adhesive and backed it with uh, in this case a project life card and in this case another one of these squares so that the edge doesn't show and it all looks very you know clean and finished and I also added a couple of the charms that we got in the kit from the Horizon collection and um, yeah so they're they actually have adhesive so they're not like loose but you still get that look of using a charm and um, you can tie this now the way I would put this in a page protector is I would probably cut um, you could like cut a flap in your page protector and then you know you could open it and read it I think that's the easiest way just you know put it in your page protector mark the edges here and then um, either yeah I would probably just cut a flap that you can move to one side when you open this and that's how I would do it and then I just added some embellishments I used some of the floral pieces I used a lot of the uh, exclusive uh, puffy stickers that we got I love these so these are from hip kits but most of this is from horizon and then the background paper is uh, from uh, Chamel it's this paper here which is called spring in the city from sparkle city and this is also a pattern paper from Paige Evans I just I trimmed it down and matted it on white cardstock again to kind of um, repeat that look of you know white cardstock matting things on white cardstock 
and um, yeah this came together super super fast because this main element especially with all the embellishments you really don't need a lot um, you can make this simpler but I love embellishing and especially floral pieces so I added some but you don't have to and yeah so sorry about not having a process video but you know life happens and uh, I hope you will create something uh, similar. It's really, really fun and easy. And then inside, you can see I added two uh, three by four project life cards, and here I added a four by six. Uh, obviously, you could add just pattern paper. Um, that would work too. So you can really customize this uh, concept. And yeah, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.